Hello, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's Saturday Fragrant Shakedown. So today for you, I have the Kenneth Cole reaction for her. So if you'd like to hear about this fragrance, um, price, notes, stuff like that, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, I do upload a daily video here on this channel all about budget beauty. So it can be a fragrance review, it can be skincare, makeup, a tutorial. It really does depend on the day of the week. So make sure you do subscribe, hit that notification bell, bookmark the page. That way you can come back and watch whenever you would like to. I also do a live stream every Sunday night at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I love getting to know you guys, so come hang out, come chat with me. I'd love to get to know you. Okay, so um, I did get this um, a while ago, um, but I haven't got to review it because I was doing my February skincare thing. So yeah, I bought this when I bought four or five other fragrances. So I did get this on sale at my local Kroger's. For two dollars and forty nine cents, this does regularly retail for about fourteen dollars. So it is a little bit pricey for a fine fragrance mist, a body spray, whatever you want to call it. So this is eight fluid ounces, pretty standard for when it comes to body sprays. Um, if you don't know what the, the difference between a perfume and a body spray is, I've explained this before, but body spray has um, a lot more alcohol. It's going to be one of the very first ingredients. Um, and then perfume has more oil, um, and it's the fragrance oil that makes a fragrance long-lasting and very potent. So body sprays, they're usually um, not as potent and they're not as long-lasting as a traditional perfume. That's basically what the difference is. So, Okay, so this Kenneth Cole reaction for her did launch in 2005, so it's 15 years old. Wow, yeah. Okay. So, um, this does have top notes, very fruity top notes of, um, let's see here, got my little notes right here. So, melon, mandarin orange, raspberry, grapefruit, apple, and watermelon. So, very, very fruity. Has middle notes of jasmine, violet leaf, lily of the valley, and orchid. Very, very nice base notes. Or, I'm sorry, mid notes. And then finally, the base notes. Base notes are cotton candy musk, vetiver, and white amber. Has kind of everything thrown in. So top notes are very fruity, mid notes are floral, and then um, the base notes sweet, but then there is musk and amber. So kind of does the whole entire gambit of fragrance. So, mm, okay. This stuff is amazing. It's sweet, okay, so when I smell this, it is very girly. Mm, so this is supposed to be like a floral woodsy musk. Um, this, I don't smell much of the fruit, even though all the top notes are fruit. Um, what I smell is, I smell like the orchid, I smell like the floral, and I smell that um, musk and the white amber. This fragrance is absolutely amazing. It smells very, very high-end. And even though this is a body spray, this does last for a really long time. Um, Kenneth Cole, it is a high-end brand, um, so it's like a fashion house, fashion brand. But this perfume, this fragrance is absolutely, absolutely amazing. Absolutely love this stuff. This, I think, would be perfect for spring. It is very sweet, but it does have those base notes of the amber and um, the musk that kind of helps ground it a little bit, but by no means is it primarily like a musk or anything like that. It's very, very sweet. Um, so if you do like a sweet fragrance, I do think you would really enjoy the Kenneth Cole reaction for her. It's a great scent kind of bummed out because I'm almost halfway through th with this and I haven't seen this at my store again and I would put this in my top 10 fragrances. I, Whenever I wear this, I always get compliments. I always kind of hate giving like a fragrance like an age group, but when I do smell this, I see this really being very... I, I feel like the people... The age group that would be attracted to this would be younger people, people that are teenagers, um, in their 20s, stuff like that. I'm in, I'm, you know, in my mid-30s almost, um, and I still really enjoy this, but 
yeah, I, I see this more being more um, up someone that's a little bit younger, like up their alley, up, you know what I mean? And I don't know, there are certain fragrances when you smell them, you're like, oh yeah, I can see my daughter enjoying that, I can see that my niece enjoying that. And there's some fragrances that you smell, and you're like, oh yeah, I think my mom would really enjoy that, or my grandma would. So yeah, when I smell this, I think of like a teenager, a uh, young woman, um, that's what I imagine when I do smell this. Once again, I'm in my mid-30s, I really like this, and I don't think fragrance is only made for a specific age. Um, I'm just kind of telling you, when I smell it, the type of people I would imagine would be drawn to this, so there we go. Um, but yes, this is a great fragrance. Um, full retail value of $14, I would pay that. It's that good of a fragrance. You do get a large 8-ounce bottle. It's a very long-lasting fragrance, even though it is a body mist, um, and it smells so high-end. It smells amazing. And like I said, top 10, and I have a lot, I'm talking a lot of fragrance. And yeah, this would this would definitely be in my top 10. It's, it's that good. Plus the packaging, I love just the pink and the silver. It's very classy looking, so yeah. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this week's Saturday Fragrance Shakedown. If you did, please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and share it. Leave a comment down below. What is your favorite springtime scent? I would love to know down below in the comments. And don't forget, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all at Budget Glam Babe. Just so you know, I do have another channel. It's called Gourmet on a Budget. It's all about budget food. So recipes and taste tests and snacks, stuff like that. So I'll link it down below for you. I upload on that one seven days a week. It's pretty fun, if I do say so myself. Um, like I said, it'll be linked down below for you. Um, don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start auto-playing here very shortly. Or you can always click on one of the ones that will be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.